picked up an appetite just oh, waiting. Actually, Sit down, let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. It's just something about a surprise, yes. Am I remembering right, or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually be forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged this as sweet as J-O-B. No. I mean, it's not as big as that, but... Just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Badass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold plated coup. So, what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, it's a deal. It's right now. All right. Let's hear what old Dex has to say. Set it up. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is all that. Oh, really? No. It's always the same story. You land on fresh turf, local fixer waves his dick around, but he's smiling. Saying you'll be up to your neck in gigs and eddies. Still, all you are is a name in their little black book. Get to get a fat slice of whatever half big shit pie their client put on the table. Sure, you crack jokes over drinks, but in the end, it's biz. Gracias, Dios. Where you know? Brunch your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust up. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Some top notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. Are we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. Right? Supposed to stop by Vix anyhow. I got a date. He had Miss Bay. Don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know. I'm mad. Mind is to Do you truly believe yeah. that those who have sold you your mechanical kind of eyes have resisted the temptation to speak through them? Hey, V. Dr. Vector will see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. You look pleased. Vicky, surprise everyone. Ripper, it's good to see you. Her good to see you, you too. Oh, wow. What do I owe the pleasure today? The last gig. I had to jack into a client's neuro socket. I think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. 
Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Any tech that could perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You hear? Chair, please. Sit down. Relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now Jack in. You peruse and choose while I scan. See what's going on inside. Mark one, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the tops of built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your... Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Play by play, though. Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky gannic hand. Good slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Thinking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Word vision, low contrast, glitches. Uh, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Seen more dramatic improvements before. Patience, kid. Give it a minute. Scanner. Take you a few seconds to adjust. But first time's rarely the charm. Fool with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes. Read your intentions. I also check an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do well. You know exactly what they ne'er did well. <laughs> it ought to work like a job. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, forget where you came from. Thank you.
Watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. Anything. V, like yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. <laughs> V, listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now, that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Sean in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Listen. Mind if I ask you something right off the bat? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from the eager supple youth. Respect. All right. All right. Listen Got close. Sure. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab, huh? Let me hear. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. Biochip to be precise. Jobs to grab. Simple. Yeah. Guessing it belongs to a court. Mm -hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Corps don't deserve special treatment. Oh, shit. <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of it. We work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the maelstrom rules. Needs active resolve in that. Second, the rendezvous. Simple. The client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue needs resolving with maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot and shot. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a military convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know maelstroms involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military. We don't get that body, we don't get no soccer chip, and we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited, it's a single use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gang made one Simon Randall, aka Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this ship's crew, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Mr. Prima Donna, 
Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding him. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter, so she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you can use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Send it in now. Client, what's your thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Bet knew it wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, we'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person. And Jaggy's only good at some things. I don't know you know what I mean. Pretty much thank you. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Mr. B. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Dexter, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nine, yeah. Clint to want to check our pro crit. But to me, it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. This is combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clepped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. I, I heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deeds of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha! <laughs> she knows. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Parker. I gotta see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. In that case, I'll hit the off road with those
Guys, I'm going to go to the next one. 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 I'm going to go to the